golden hour you see how pretty it is outside I just love this time of the night um, it's about I say it's probably about 730 now I was supposed to take the boat out today but I stayed up way too late last night and I didn't want to get up and then been homebound so I just laid around and then I finally got my shower and then I decided I didn't want to do anything today so yeah much needed rest so we're gonna get back out there though <laughs> oh no, he come off. Well, yeah. no, that counts. That counts. happened to the worm but um <laughs> just got a decent sized largemouth here y'all <laughs> great <laughs> look at the worm <laughs> nice fish chunky little bass here we are, we're gonna let it go Don't you just love it? Just love it. Catch and release. Catch and release. <laughs> and now we gotta get us a new worm. So, I'll see y'all. So I forgot to mention that that was my first day of our shaky head fish. Would you be quiet? No. First day of our shaky head fish, and I'm really excited about it.
know, we caught one to end the video on. That was kind of cool. Um, I do not remember what the name of that uh, Berkeley worm is. Uh, but that's a new Berkeley worm that I ordered off one of my uh, previous tackle warehouse orders. And it's like a it's like a flat worm. Uh, like the pot, I know they got the Berkeley flat worm, but it doesn't look like that at all. It's like a long, flat, skinny worm, and it's got like a little ball uh, or something on the back of the tail. But the ball is like flat. It looks like somebody took, they poured a ball and then they smushed it. So it looked like. Let me get this hook out. What the heck? There it is, little teeny tiny guy, but got one of the drop shots, so let me put this back real quick. Let you go. Bye. I'm gonna go get one of them worms really quick, and then I'm gonna tell y'all uh, what it's called. So y'all know, cause I knew that this worm would be a great drop shot worm and I've gotten like at least 14 little hits with this worm alone just being out here. I don't know if y'all can see the rod tip bouncing up and down but this is like 8 pound line. Uh, I think it's sun line. Um, but any 8 pound line will do the trick. So, And then obviously it's a, that's about how long my leader is. So, Pretty cool. I'll come see you in a second. All right, y'all. Um, so the worm is actually called straight money, uh, and then the color of this one is plump, plum. So that's what it looks like. You see, it's got that little flat part on the tail there, and it ain't but like a little four-inch worm. Really, really good little lure though. It smells terrible, but. Like, what the heck? <laughs> Thank you, buddy. Oh, sorry, 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 sorry. Don't do that, don't do that. Don't do that, friend. Friend! I mean, excuse me, you're on land. You're not going to win this battle. Just let you know. Oh, just let you know. You're a feisty little booger. I thought we were friends. That's one of the day. Yeah, that is that uh, Berkeley Stripe Money Worm, and I think it's going to be one of my new favorite drop shot worms. So. I like it a lot. But y'all, um, that is going to be it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, y'all will notice that this is a three day in one adventure um i was gonna take the boat out but i didn't so this will be three days of me pond hopping essentially so hope y'all enjoyed the video i'm gonna try to take some cool pictures of the pond before the low the, before the uh light gets too low on me with my other lens so um, y'all stay tuned. I might have some, uh, pretty big news. May not, uh, I don't really know yet, but, uh, y'all stay tuned, and I can't wait to share with y'all if it happens, and y'all have a great day.